We are found. We are the 26. I am working with the Como Youth Engagement Program. Como Youth Engagement Program. The Como Youth Engagement Program is a program that encourages youth to become conservation leaders in their community through product-based learning. Our research involved collecting rainwater from members of the community in St. Paul, so any households that are willing to volunteer, and then testing those collected jars of water for particular contaminants in the water just to sort of disprove any myths about uh, the contents of that water, the safety of that water, as well as to assess sort of the understanding of the community around any misconceptions about rain barrels or water conservation. At our school, uh, we noticed that there was a lot of issues with recycling and food waste in our cafeteria. So we decided we would um, have a campaign to promote recycling um, through giving away free water bottles. Um, in order to get the water bottles, you had to participate in educational ca um, activities in the cafeteria regarding recycling. Yeah, um, and uh, we also instituted a share table where um, kids who uh, had food that they didn't want that they took in the lunch line, could leave it there for other kids who couldn't buy lunch to um, take. Or if you're hungry. Or if you're hungry. The Failing Trees Fest is a festival in the winter and it's supposed to so encourage teenagers to come out in the winter. Failing Trees Fest comes every year. We do Ice fishing, snow shoeing, sledding, and cooking. What my project really was about is it's just a free seed giveaway, uh, giving back to the community so that they can have a chance to try and growing something on their own. Because it's important that everyone has a fair chance to try and grow something, because without that, people really don't get a meaningful connection to nature. So it's important that people are able to have that chance because it encourages conservation in the next generation. People who were interested in learning how to participate in the game got to win a water bottle. 98 water bottles were distributed. A lot of people, they still use their water bottles. Um, I know personally a lot of people who use the share table and they find it a really great uh, thing to have in the cafeteria, especially if they just want like a quick apple or an extra orange or something like that. Um, they really like that. And and we've noticed a uh, cut down on the plastic water bottles used mm. in the lunchroom. So that was also an impact for some. Um, I guess I picked up on how rewarding it is to actually see um, something come out of your work just because this was a year-long project. It was hard work, but when we finally got the grant and we were able to get the rain barrel in, that was really um, rewarding. Yeah, so I mean, most of what we've learned is that it, it really takes a lot of people um, and a lot of time to see significant progress in conservation work, but that it really is worthwhile. I have so much respect <laughs> for people who do this for a living. It's kind of, it's exhausting to think about how many different areas that conservation work can possibly affect and how much there is to do, but it's also really heartening to see uh, the amount of people who are really, who are really enthusiastic about continuing these kinds of efforts. Youth should get more involved in conservation work as well. There should be more programs like the Youth Engagement Program because people have always been putting work off to the next generation over and over and over again. I mean, if you're gonna do that, you might as well create youth programs to help them then. Because this generation is not some generation that knows very well about getting out into the, na into the world and conserving it. It's more about technology-based. And I think that's great, but you're also forgetting about the environment, and by having a program like the Youth Engagement Program that teaches people about conservation, it really helps this generation understand what it means to give back to a community.